Hello students, welcome back. The question is from gate 2001 and this one is for 2 marks. Let's just read the statement first, then I'll provide the solution. Consider the circuit given below with initial state Q0 is equal to 1, Q1 and Q2 is equal to 0. The state of circuit is given by the value 4Q2 plus 2Q1 plus Q0. Which one of the following is correct state sequence of the circuit? Just have a look at the given four options. Okay. Now in diagram it's given that this bit is the MSB. Okay. And this bit Q0 will be the LSB, least significant bit. Okay. That means say at any given time the value of Q0 is 0, Q1 is 1 and Q2 is 1. What will be the state of this counter? This one is MSB that means start from here. Most significant bit, then this one and then the least significant bit. You can see 110 means 6. Okay. But they have given this formula to find out the state. Let us contemplate what is this formula. See it is nothing but just the formula to convert a normal 3 digit binary number to a decimal number. See this one is 2 raised to the power 2. So first bit that is Q0 into 2 raised to the power 2. Then second bit which is Q1 into 2 raised to the power 1. Okay. Then third bit into 2 raised to the power 0. That is how you convert a normal binary number into a decimal number. Okay. So that's just given to confuse you. Anyways, now let's try to fill the truth table for this counter. You can see whatever is this input will be given in output. Okay, this is property of a D flip flop. That means if input D1 is 1, on seeing a clock signal, this output will be changed to 1. That means this one will be given in the output. Okay, if this is 0, 0 will be given in the output. That means whatever is the output Q0, okay, that will be copied as it is in output of Q1 upon seeing a positive clock. Okay. So the column for Q0 is this. That means whenever a clock signal is given, this bit, it will be copied as it is in Q1. Okay. Similarly, this bit will be copied here. Similarly, entire column can be copied. Okay. Parallelly, Q1 will be copied in Q2. So I'm doing that. Now you can see whatever is this input D0 will be given as output Q2 upon seeing a clock signal. Okay, let us first find what is this D0. D0 is XOR of Q1 and Q2. That means whatever is the XOR of Q1 and Q2 will be this output Q0. So let me found, find out XOR of Q1 and Q2. This is Q1 and Q2 their XOR will be given as the next state Q0. Okay. So this is Q0N, the next state of Q0. So their XOR has to be written in this column. That's what you will get upon filling this table. Now, let us just take one example so that we understand this table properly. Say so this is 1, this is 0, this is 1. So the state is 1, 0, 1. 1, 0, 1, uh, which means 5. Okay. This output is 1, that means we have a 1 here. This is 0, that means we have a 0 here. Okay. 0, 0, XOR 1 will give you 1. Okay, so we have a 1 here. So whenever a clock signal is given, this bit, that means value of Q0, which is 1, will be given as value of Q1. Okay, so Q1 will become Q1 will become 1, Q2 will become 0, and Q0, it will become 1. Okay, so after 5, the next state is 3. From here also you can verify 
वन जीरो वन गोज टू जीरो वन वन ओके दिस इज अ वन नाउ लेट्स जस्ट ड्रॉ दैट स्टेट सीक्वेंस सो यू कैन सी स्टेट जीरो हैज अ सेल्फ लूप बिकॉज इफ यू आर ऑन दिस स्टेट अपॉन सींग अ पॉजिटिव क्लॉक यू विल रिमेन ऑन स्टेट जीरो ओनली ओके सो आई ड्रॉन अ सेल्फ लूप वेन यू आर ऑन स्टेट वन यू विल गो टू स्टेट टू ओके सो स्टेट वन गोज टू स्टेट टू स्टेट टू गोज टू स्टेट फाइव वेन यू आर ऑन स्टेट फाइव दैट मीन्स यूर अपॉन सींग अ क्लॉक सिग्नल यू विल गो टू स्टेट थ्री फाइव गोज टू थ्री When you are on state three, that means here you will go to state seven. Okay. When you are on state seven, upon seeing a positive edge of clock, you will go to one one zero, which is six. When you are on state six, you will go to state four. So we have four here. And from state four, this is four. You will go to state one. That means you will reach. to the starting state again okay this is the counting sequence this one and this one let us see which option is correct so option number b is the answer it says 1 2 5 3 7 6 4 1 2 5 3 7 6 4 yeah this is the counting sequence for the given counter yeah so i just forgot to mention one thing they have said the initial state is value of q not as 1 okay this one is 0 and this one is also 0 so the initial state is q2 q1 q not which is 0 0 1 that means initial state is 1 so we are here actually we begin from here and you keep on giving as many as clocks you want you will never exit this loop see upon seeing one clock you will go here upon seeing next clock you will go here upon seeing three more clocks you will reach here upon seeing two clocks you will reach here and so on okay so that's the reason they haven't included zero in the answer okay because this state is not reachable from any of these states if you begin from here your answer will be 1 2 5 3 7 6 4 which is option b so answer is option b okay